The cheapest way to ship large packages, a complete guide. Freight shipping is more complicated than shipping small parcels. Your shipping costs depend on your package's density, dimensional weight, and vehicle or craft. Software simplifies finding the best shipping solution every time. This article will teach you how to find the cheapest way to ship large packages, whether locally or internationally. Freight shipping versus parcel shipping? Freight shipping differs from parcel delivery. For freight shipping beginners, delivery estimates may change. Freight shippers give an ETA, but unlike Priority Mail Express and other small parcel shipping options, on-time delivery is rarely guaranteed. Freight shipping, which will explain, makes it hard to predict delivery times. Specify what you're sending. Couriers use Bill of Lading BOL, cargo manifests to ship freight. Shippers must know what's in your boxes or on your pallet to safely transport them. Contractual Bill If something gets damaged or lost during shipment, that document will be used to settle the dispute, so fill it out correctly. Density matters. Density, not just size and weight, affects parcel shipping rates. Heavy non-freight parcels, without hazardous or prohibited materials, cost more to send. Heavy freight shipping doesn't always cost more. Ping pong balls cost more to ship than bricks because they're lighter and more likely to break. Calculating freight class. Your items and MFC depends on several factors. Product size and weight, this is used to determine density. Storing items. Handling specifications. Transporting your items, electronics are more likely to attract thieves. This freight class shipping calculator can help you estimate your freight class, but your freight broker is the best source. If you're shipping high value, hard to stow, or fragile goods, your freight class will likely be higher. How to ship large packages cheaply. Freight Quote or Freightos offer the best freight shipping rates. Business owners use freight brokers to quickly compare freight shipping costs from multiple couriers and find the best rates. Pricing depends on what you're shipping, the carrier, USPS versus UPS backslash, how far it needs to go, and other factors. Air shipping is usually the most expensive, but there are exceptions. As a shipment gets smaller, the margin between the prices, of air and ocean shipping, gets smaller and sometimes air will even end up less expensive, Universal Cargo said. Shipping, fuel, and import slash export surcharges change, complicating matters. Weather and global events like COVID-19 affect shipping prices and turnaround times. Comparing quotes quickly is more important than knowing which shipper is cheapest, since the answer changes. Many 3PLS and warehouses help e-commerce businesses and others choose affordable shipping options. Some businesses forget freight transportation options. Couriers and self-delivery are other freight transport options for local customers. If your small business can't afford a delivery van, on-demand delivery services are convenient and affordable. GoShare can quickly dispatch couriers for pallet or LTL deliveries. Local deliveries are best done by your team. Self-delivery is advantageous and doesn't require a commercial driver. Sprinters with pallet loaders can carry 6,000 pounds. As Brian Scudamore, CEO of O2E Brands, wrote, Outsiders will never have the same level of commitment to your vision, as you do. Controlling your customer experience is important. Self-delivery benefits Optimo Route. Optimo Route helps companies deliver all kinds of cargo last mile. Optimo Route lets you deliver large packages in-house, whether you're transporting bricks or temperature-sensitive foods. Optimo Route's capabilities include Plan routes and deliveries 5 weeks in advance automatically. To maximize vehicle efficiency, consider cargo capacity. Multi-day long-haul delivery routes. Track your field team live. Set delivery windows. Limit driver hours by availability and overtime. Most importantly, provide excellent customer service. Freight shipping methods, pros and cons. After determining your freight class, density, and bill of lading, you can transport your freight four ways. 1. Ground shipping. Large boxes are most often shipped domestically by tractor trailer, for example UPS ground or FedEx ground. Trucks move over half of US freight. Pros, ground shipping offers more flexibility than other modes of transportation. Trucks can drop off cargo anywhere there's a road, which is important for businesses that can't unload cargo from ships or planes and safely transport it to their store or warehouse. Cons, trucking packages takes longer and increases security risk. 
Ground isn't ideal for next day delivery of large packages. Trucks make multiple stops, especially if your shipment is less than a truckload, which increases the chances of something being broken or stolen. Flat tires, traffic, and other issues can delay trucks. 2. Seafaring Ocean shipping is the most popular freight transport method worldwide, but ground shipping dominates in the US. The Maritime Executive reported that 70% of global freight is shipped. Pros, ocean freight is popular because 71% of the planet is water. Because of that, most international shipping options are boats and planes. Ocean shipping is much cheaper than air freight. Air freight costs five times more than sea freight. Cons, the downside to ocean shipping is that it's slow. A cargo ship takes 15 days to travel from Hong Kong to Los Angeles, while an aeroplane takes 15 hours. Ocean shipping is also dangerous. Rough seas can damage cargo, cargo ship fires are common, and maritime shipping still faces piracy. 3. Rail shipping Lumber, paper, grain, and ore are typically shipped by rail. Pros, rail shipping is usually the best option for shipping heavy items in large quantities, more than a truckload, via land. Rail cars can carry four times more cargo than tractor trailers and ship bulk goods cheaper. Cons, the biggest drawback to rail shipping is the physical travel limitations. Trains can only travel on rails, so they can't usually deliver cargo. Many freight shipments use intermodal rail and ground shipping. 4. Air shipping Airplanes are best for urgent cargo. It's expensive. Pros, the clear advantage to air shipping is the speed. Air freight is 24 times faster than ocean shipping. Air freight is the fastest. Cons, speed is usually expensive. Freitos says a medium-sized 2,000 pounds box from Shenzhen, China to New York, USA, can cost $1,200 by ocean but a whopping $4,000 by air. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and like the video. See you soon, have a great day.